A base hit for the Major League Baseball tax hike plan. Utah's run for MLB advancing today in its first test at the state capitol. Brian Malahi is joining us there live. So lots of support for this, Brian. Was the vote unanimous? It was not a shutout today, but the score to send the baseball plan flying was not even close. Eight to two. To make this desolate area near the Fair Park in Salt Lake look something like a field of dreams. This is a historic investment at the nexus of sports and community. Today, with one power hitter after another. Please know of my unwavering support. It seemed a grand slam of acclamation. It will be the most phenomenal, transformational investment the West Side has ever seen. It's more of a swing and a miss. Representative Norm Thurston was one of two to vote no. The problem for me is that this is a tax increase to fund a private sector project. Baseball bill backers say the plan is low risk and that at under $900 million, the state would pay less than half of what the stadium will cost. What can you say to assure people that this cost estimate is going to be close to where it ends up. The bill as it's drafted caps the state. If there's any overruns, that's that's borne by Big League Utah. This bill would raise hotel room taxes and rental car taxes throughout the entire state. Measure now in the House. Live at the Capitol, Brian Malahi, KUTV2 News.